A high school football player is making a comeback after a serious injury with the help of the surgeons over at ORA Orthopedics. News H Angie Sharp brings us tonight's Let's Move Quad City segment. Hey! Travis Crayenhagen is kicking off his senior year on the Assumption High School football team. But he almost didn't make the cut two years ago. My leg had been sore all week and I just thought it was nothing but like a groin pole or something and then it progressively got worse. For that pain became an injury. Travis tore the cartilage in his right hip. They told us he may never kick again uh, and that was discouraging but then uh, we still had to do the surgery when we still had to do the rehab. Fortunately both worked. How was kicking going? Absolutely fine. There's no pain at all. Thanks in part to new technology provided by Dr. Andy Breeze and ORA Orthopedics. We actually put the, a scope inside the joint, so it's done with just tiny little incisions. Um, and we use special tables so we can see inside there and work around. What it's allowed us to do is basically work on a joint that we previously couldn't without doing huge open dissections and having all these complications. It's a minimally invasive approach that allows the, the athlete or the person to get back to their activities faster. Travis is one of the lucky ones, according to Dr. Breeze. You know, he does a lot of rollbacks and that kind of stuff yeah. and a lot of swiveling with the hips. So Specializing in sports medicine, yeah. he spends time with several athletes and teams across the area. You take your chance, stay in your lane, don't be outside, kick it down. And he says a lot has changed over the years that players and parents need to know about. There's too much going on. There's overuse injuries, too many sports injuries. There's too many kids getting hurt. According to researchers, 2.6 million children end up in the ER every year with sports and recreation related injuries. Half of those are overuse injuries. And Dr. Breeze says he knows why. Uh, we didn't see a lot of the injuries we see now 15 years ago because people played three, four sports. They had time off. They never never really dedicated themselves to one sport. So they allowed their body to rest. And I think some athletes are quitting sports because they're hurting and they can't get over their injury. That was almost Travis's story. I really wanted to get back, help all, help all the other guys, help the team out, contribute. Instead, he took his time, spending six months in physical therapy. Right away, you want to start doing more than you should. And so holding them back through rehab, not to do too much, was more of a challenge than uh, the actual rehab itself. I think he's stronger now than he was before, and uh, so, I mean, it, it's, everything turned out really good. Days away from the season opener, number 56 is ready for action. With a goal and an experience that sends a message, let's move QC. Angie Sharp, WQAD News 8. Thank you, Angie, and the Assumption Knights kick off their football season this Thursday night. Dr. Breeze says the type of surgery performed on Travis's hip can also work on most other joints, including shoulders, elbows, and knees.